Hello, dear friends, fellow workers of the light, star seeds, way showers, rainbow warriors. I am Julie Joy, your servant of the light, with another powerful message from Yeshua. This channel by Galaxy Girl for April 18th, 2021. And he begins, I am Yeshua. I come through this one today as I come through many of you. Many of you have within you the essence of me, for we are all one. We are all aspects of Source in various forms. Therefore, we are all connected and separation is truly impossible. It is possible to become so ensconced and entrapped by the human mind and dogma to feel an illusory separation. This is what is crumbling as humanity rises further from the interdimensional entrapment and falsities of religious programming. People are waking up to the God self within. It is really quite simple. You are aspects of Source. And Galaxy Girl says, I am seeing a beautiful kaleidoscope of all colors. I see the kaleidoscope moving, the picture ever changing, but all the colors remain within the kaleidoscope. And he replies, Source is changing forms and colors and bodies all the time. You are aspects of this Source. Your soul's journey is an integral part of the whole. Just as one grain of sand is an important part of the whole, as all is one. The essence of the grain of sand comes from that which was before. And Galaxy Girl says, I am seeing a sea creature with a shell. And Yeshua replies, the past life of that grain of sand is a part of it, yes? You are all integrating the past memories and experiences that you have suffered from and are still processing. It is true. There is much to process. There is much to understand. There is time to process these things. As an eternal being on an endless journey, there is time immeasurably to process. But the time of the Earth experiment runs short, is closing. And Galaxy Girl says, I am seeing an ancient book closing that is tattered and worn. I am seeing a new beautifully glowing golden book opening. And his reply, the human experiment of darkness is not immune to the light. The light is the cure to the darkness and pain that humanity has suffered, but they must realize that their God self is within. This will be a very, very difficult teaching for many, and they will be closed to it. But that is their choice, dear ones. That is their choice on their journey. You are here to offer a hand, to lend a vibrational frequency of assistance. You are not there to make their decision for them. Do you feel the difference? I came to Gaia as a guide, as a vibrational offering and encoding that began furthered the seeding of the Christed consciousness that is now blossoming in the hearts of those who believe in the light within. I am the same light. I came from Source, as did you. Equality of Source. We are all the same grains of sand from the same beginnings. Do you see? You need not worship me. You may talk with me as a revered friend and brother. Speak up, talk to me, talk with whomever you best resonate of the higher dimensional frequencies. The universe is listening. The God self within is listening. Manifestation will become smoother, more spontaneous. This one, and he's referring to Galaxy Girl, is thinking of a child who manifested a whole in one. That was spectacular, Ernie, spectacular. You are doing excellently, my friend. Keep it up. You would all learn best from the children. They are more familiar with the vibrations of home. It is not such a distant memory for them. It is not. The children coming in now are even more closely in remembrance of their home of the womb of source. This one recently meditated within the void. Would you like to feel that space? And Galaxy Girl says, I am back in the void with Yeshua. There is nothing but infinite potential. Space, love. I surround myself in a bubble for light. 
And he says this is an excellent place to conjure your manifestations, to believe in the best for humanity. This is where new creations are born, conceived and then birthed into matter eventually, depending on the vibrational alignment. Friends, envision new earth with me, with us. Envision what you want to experience. And Galaxy Girl says, I am seeing gardens, a green, healthy earth, endless light in the blue skies. The air is thick and warm and welcoming. I am hearing animals in the trees. I am in a jungle. There is no fear of any predators, and I am comfortable barefoot. The bark on the trees is warm and welcoming. I feel the energy of the trees. I feel the sunlight on my hair. I feel the coolness beneath my feet on the earthy floor. And Yeshua replies, Now, friends, envision everyone having plenty. Envision everyone glowing within at peace with their origin of source, at peace in their manifestations, for they will only be of the highest vibrational alignment. Humanity has been so complacent, so programmed, their lights so dimmed. It is time to change this. I shook things up there in my incarnation, and you are aware of my story, but you do not know all of my story, as it is rare that within human form you truly know a person's entire story. You see a person for bits of a time, for moments, and sometimes a series of years, but you may not know what triggered a response or what past life memory resurfaced that they don't know how to process or are in the midst of reprocessing. And so, have grace with yourselves, with each other. Have grace in this tremendous time of upheaval and rebirth. Have the stamina to continue to be solidly determined, unyielding in your promise to hold only to the higher dimensional frequencies, for this is making a tremendous vibrational bridge that will assist the many. Peace. I am Yeshua. I come through this one today as I come through many of you. We will be better aligned if you remember to speak with me more often, more fully. I am here for you. The times of darkness are at a close and you are here to bear witness to this eternal truth of the inner God being revealed. This will be a difficult truth for many and they will be closed off to it. The earth program has been arduous. So many have lost their way, but so many are finding their way back to source, back to the God within, back to that precious vibrational cord of alignment, of peace, of instant manifestation of all that is good, pure, and beautiful. Love is the heartbeat of the universe, of creation, Source is love. Source is all things. You are a part of this infinite beach of infinite grands of sand that extends further into the distance than the human mind can fathom. All are from the same beginning and all will have the same end. For all is source. Feel this love. Feel this hope. Feel this encodement and know who you are. Know who you are, friends. Know that you were born for this moment, for this time, in this spacesuit, in this body, for a reason. Your reasons will become more fully known, but know that you are ready. You are ready and you are loved, and you are not alone. You are surrounded by the light and the love of the many invisible hands that gently nudge you onward and wipe the unshed tears from your eyes. You are surrounded by the many helpful hands and feet that are beside you in every moment. For we are all one. We are assisting continually, moment by moment, and we will not stop until this project is ultimately blessed by the return of the realization of the truth of the all that is. Peace, brothers and sisters, peace. You are blessed beyond measure. All that you need is within you. I am beside you, walking the eternal beach beside you, friend. Open up, expand, and rest in this knowing. Be at peace. I am Yeshua. 
This was channeled by Galaxy Girl. Something that he suggested in this message is something that's just recently come to me. Now I know it came from him. Remember back in the Bible when he blessed the fish and the loaves of bread for thousands of people that came to hear him speak his truth? Many of us grew up in households that offered grace or a blessing at every meal. Why not resume this practice? Offer the food that you are about to eat to the masses in Yeshua's name, that it may be spread far and wide to each and every person on this planet. Everyone deserves to have plentiful food, clean drinking water, and a safe place. You, my light worker friends, have the power to do this. Please help. This message is too long to place below in the more about section, but I will post this on the Sananda.website as well as voyagesoflight.blogspot.com. I am Julie Joy, your servant of the light, and it's my honor and pleasure to bring you such a powerful, powerful message from Yeshua.